officially Leo season. Thank you guys so much for all the birthday messages and well wishes. I'm having an amazing time in Puerto Rico. <laughs> all right, so you guys have made it all the way to day four, which was our last day here in Puerto Rico. And the last day was officially my birthday, which was July 29th. That was me just thanking everybody for their messages, DMs, text messages, just showing me love um, for my birthday. It was very much appreciated. So when I got up that morning, um, it was a beautiful morning. So I was taken to go get a full body massage down the street from the hotel. And um, I definitely needed that. I definitely needed a massage. And so after the massage, I was taken out to brunch. And the brunch spot that we went to, I forgot the name of it, but they were so sweet. It was in Las Marias, and I had these blueberry pancakes. They were so good. And then the restaurant staff came over. They found out it was my birthday. So they came to sing me happy birthday and bring me another dessert. It was really dope. It was such a great spot. You had to have reservations, though, because there's usually like a long line. But um, they got us in right away. And then after that, we went down to the beach because like I told you guys, anywhere you look in Puerto Rico, there's a beach. So we were down by this beach and the beach was gorgeous. Um, from what I heard, that part of the beach that we were at was one of the nicest parts. But um, there was all types of graffiti art. So I was stopping and taking pictures in front of the artwork because it kind of matched my dress. So it was just really nice. I met a really cool guy there. Um, he was telling me all about it. He had moved to Puerto Rico from Connecticut. So he was telling me all about that section of Puerto Rico. And then after brunch, I was surprised with a helicopter ride. Now, I'm gonna keep it real. I know what a helicopter is, obviously, right? But I didn't think it was gonna be that much of a difference than being on a plane. I kind of felt like, well, I've been on an airplane, so it shouldn't be much of a difference. When I tell you, it is a big difference between getting on a commercial airplane and a helicopter. Literally a big difference. So we had to sign waivers and everything, and um, we got on there, and who we? Uh, it totally took my breath away. I am getting ready to go on my first helicopter ride for my birthday, representing Leo season. Never been in a helicopter before, but I'm super duper excited. So you guys are gonna come with me, okay, tea sippers, on this helicopter ride. So come on. After that we landed safely and um, it was amazing it was a very amazing experience to be that high up in the air with literally nothing you know around us like nothing it was definitely a whole different view up there from being on a commercial flight and just looking out of a window but um, he did a great job he made me feel really comfortable and we had a good time and so after that, um, it was time for me to get back to the hotel and change into my swimsuit because we we're going to do a small party for me at the pool before we went to our final farewell slash birthday party dinner. And so um, I get there and everybody just starts singing happy birthday to me as I'm walking in and these ladies are just so sweet. We had an amazing time. We took lots of pictures. Then we walked over to Platos and we had an amazing time at Platos. They really looked out for us. Thank you. 
So after kicking at the pool, we all went upstairs, got dressed, and then I headed over to Platos, and I was very shocked at how they just had everything set up beautifully. The wait staff was just amazing, and um, they let us hook up our Bluetooth and play music. They literally allowed us to turn up the restaurant. We had so much fun just playing music and listening to songs and dancing and everything else that even the restaurant staff was joining in. They started rapping with us to they not like us. Um, people in the restaurant started dancing. Like we had the whole place turned up. It was amazing. And here goes some clips of that. Turned up, 
up, finally got some food in our bellies, had some cake. It was time to open presents. And I was surprised. I was very shocked. I did not expect anybody to get me a gift. Just their presence enough was a present to me. But um, I just, you know, thank everybody who came, who got me a gift. It just meant a lot to me. Um, they were just wonderful. And I've been having a great time at bath time. I got a lot of Lush products, beautiful charms. Um, so I just really appreciate each and every one of you guys. I appreciate the cards that you guys gave me, the candles, the representing of Leo season. Um, and of course, y'all know I had to break down crying um, in the middle of all this. But yes, they were definitely happy tears um, when it's all said and done. And even watching this back gets me emotional because like I told you guys there, this was like probably one of the best birthdays I've had in my adult life. So um, once again, I just really appreciate everybody coming out and celebrating with me. And, you know, usually when you're grown, people don't even give you a card sometimes or a gift. So the fact that you guys did all of that for me, um, including surprising me with the cake and everything, this was just very, very memorable. And I really, really appreciate it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. so hard why we celebrate the whole season because when we were kids there were no birthdays for us in the classroom because we were summertime yeah. babies mm. so you know you would see all the other kids like all the other zodiacs like oh you know their moms and dads would bring like cupcakes and everybody singing happy birthday mm -hmm. we never got that <laughs> so we love you so much understand that you are truly a blessing to all of us yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 thank you guys so much Thank you. You're gonna go international. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this brace is about to be lit. Yeah. 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 Okay, you yeah, it's homemade, right? I, I love the smell. This one's great. I like kissing. The Leo symbol. Okay, I knew there was a symbol. Constellation, y'all can see the symbol. Thank you so much. Let the head of one. 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 After we got done turning up at Platos, um, we stayed until they closed, like literally. We all decided to go down to La Placita, which is like where the clubs are at in Puerto Rico, and they're dope. You can go in and out the clubs. Um, it's free. Everybody was up there turning up. We had such a fun time. Y'all know wherever the tea sippers go, we gonna bring that energy. So we had a lot of people joining our group and dancing with us, and it was so fun down there. It was definitely a vibe. So definitely make sure if, when you're in Puerto Rico, you go to La Placita. Why you showing up, bitch? Ain't you tired? 
tell you we turned up like nobody's business in La Placita we had the club turned out we had a ball it was so fun um it was just good to just spend that last night together just you know kicking it relaxing but it was also sad too so after um the club we didn't want to go home so everybody was like come on let's go to the beach one last time so we decided to go back to our favorite beach near the hotel and that is where we spent our last night we walked past our favorite restaurant that we did not eat at because i refused to eat at burger king in puerto rico but la casa de la whopper yes honey i'm my spanish is coming together okay so it was just i had to take a picture of that one last time but yeah, we just had a really good time. I just, this was an amazing experience. And again, I thank all of the people who came, all of the people that we met along the way, um, even the tea sippers that I just, you know, happened to run into at the airport and at the restaurants. It was good getting a chance to meet you guys as well. So, you know, I can't wait to do a round two. I really appreciate everybody who came out to celebrate my birthday week with me and to celebrate Leo season with me. Um, I couldn't have picked a better group of people, and we will definitely do it again. So I'll talk to y'all later. Thank y'all for tuning in. All right, so this is my last day in Puerto Rico. I had such a good time. When I tell you Puerto Rico don't owe me nothing, honey, they owe me nothing at all. This was an amazing, blessed time. We shed a lot of tears this weekend, lots of smiles, laughter, and everything else. But I wouldn't have wanted to have this trip with nobody else but the group I went with. And once again, thank you ladies so much for coming down here and spending my birthday in Puerto Rico. Like this is, I have so many memories. And I conquered a lot of fears. I didn't know what to expect coming here, but I came back stronger. I now want to learn Spanish and I plan on coming to Puerto Rico like all the time now. This is going to be like my second or third home. I cannot wait. <laughs> If you want the latest news in the streets, join us sentiment for the tea. Breaking news with integrity, so sell your friends and your family. It's the Lovely Tea TV Show, bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the Lovely Tea TV Show, be sure to share, like, and subscribe.